five years ago, Irish whiskey was the hottest category out there and a ton of multinationals built distilleries and they jumped into the category and they rushed into it. And it's doing okay, but the fact remains that there was already perfectly delicious, unbelievably good Irish whiskey on the market. Redbreast was one of them, Jameson was one of them, Bushmills was one of them. We didn't really need all these new Irish whiskeys, uh, in my personal opinion, because we had the original Redbreast 12-year it's gotten more expensive, but it's still absolutely delicious. It's soft, it's sweet, it's fruity, it's so drinkable, but it has a ton of flavor. It's just got finesse and balance and really everything you want in a whiskey, especially in an Irish whiskey. Let's take a sip. Signature grassiness, core sweetness, a little bit of malt. There's citrus there. There's tropical fruit. There's a sherry influence. So you get a little bit of orchard fruit as it finishes, a little bit of leather. It's so, so easy to drink and so delicious. Red breast is something you should be drinking all year round, not just uh, close to St. Patrick's Day. Cheers.